guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Ariana, and today's video is going to be a what's on my iPhone. Don't mind how I look. I legit just got back from class, so don't mind how I look. But I was trying to figure out what kind of video I wanted to do, and I was like, hmm, maybe I'll do what's on my iPhone. Real simple, real cute. So that's what we're about to do right now. I have the iPhone 13 Pro Max. I have it in the, like, green color this is what my phone looks like um it's really nice it has like the shiny outside and then i have a privacy screen as well but um yeah and then this is my phone case i got it from wildflower cases it's so cute i love their cases super protective super durable but we're about to just get started right with this video i'm gonna put my phone like on this side because you know cover up my mess in my bed keep it cute um but anyways this is my screensaver it's me and my boyfriend this is my favorite picture of us and then on the outside i just have um the time and then i usually have reminders right there and then i have the weather outside and then a date and then a time nothing really special i just like having it it's easy to look at when i'm just trying to check the time or check to see the weather or something but this is my home screen um let me hold it down so you guys can see my home screen wallpaper so this i got this off pinterest it says a negative mind will never give you a positive life love the positive vibes i love always thinking positive or having positive quotes around me just makes me happy i don't know i just like it and i like pink so but basically i got the widget also it's a pinterest board it's like my positive quotes pinterest board on my pinterest is periodically so you can go check that out but it just says it just has a quote every single like i think it changes every hour i believe but it says ask yourself what is really important and then have the courage to build your life around your answer nice little quote i try to look at these sometimes so it's mostly there for decoration but i mean it's whatever and then the second widget down in the right corner it just has my um charging thing so like my apple watch percentage usually my airpods is up there too if they're in my ear and then my phone percentage and then at the bottom i just have all of the apple stuff so like phone message facetime and mail i always every new phone I always put those down there i don't know why it's just easy to have those in the same place i don't know but all of my apps are on this one wallpaper i don't have a second one so that's good because I don't like having to swipe, swipe, swipe for different apps. But anyways, in my first box, we have social media. So this just has Snapchat, Instagram, GroupMe, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Pinterest, Messenger, and Disney+. And then in the next one, it has Be Real. And then into Intel Fluence. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's like to get brand deals or just to help you start getting brand deals. So I started using that recently. Um, so first is Snapchat. And then Instagram. Follow me on Instagram as well. And it grew me I use for my um, school. So it has like, we have one where it's like class 2026. That's like what a lot of people from like freshman class of Southern is in. And then we have my um, dorm halls, you know, on group me and Facebook. That's mainly for family. I don't really give that out. And it's what you can follow me on Twitter. It's Ariana Calise as well. And it takes out you can follow me on there. And then Pinterest, I love Pinterest. I like to go in here to get ideas. Recently I've been on Pinterest to get a lot of apartment inspo. So we have apartment inspo, and then we have tattoo inspo for when I wanna have the courage to get a tattoo. And then we have nails, picture. This is when I had a uh, small picture collage wall back at home. So I got a lot of pictures from Pinterest and then alpha inspo, vacation alpha inspo, hairstyles, lash names, music playlists, dorm inspo, just a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. And then we have Messenger. I use that for Facebook when people text me off of Facebook. Goes to there. Disney Plus. I don't know why it's in social media. I think it's because I put it in here because this is the only like TV app I have on my phone now. So I just put it where I always be at. And then Be Real. Add me on Be Real if you want to. I think it's Ariana Calise too. And all my social media is Ariana Calise if you want to be honest. But um, yeah. Next one is shopping. So we have Sheen, Amazon, Fifth Third, obviously from my bank. I'm not gonna show you that. Cash App, I'm not gonna really show you that either because people be trying to scam. And we have Princess Polly, my favorite clothing place to shop. Then you have Shop. Shop is where you can track all of your packages. I recommend you get it. So like you get to the order number, tracking number, whatever you get, and then it can help you track it, tell you when it's delivered, tell you when it leaves, to like the warehouse and all that. Afterpay, you know split your payments up to, to four fashion of it and we have sephora my also my favorite app as well 
fetch rewards this is to um so like you can scan your seats on here and earn points and you can earn like gift cards to different places so i i used to have like 15,000, but i used it but you basically just scan your seat and then you can get up all these rewards so say since i got 8,000, i only can get a 5,000 reward right now and you can get any of these gift cards but i like to save it and build it up because what you don't give a five five dollars really you have aliexpress i sometimes get wigs off here or if i want to get like a bulk of something i get off here or alibaba and we have goat you know to get shoes and then also beauty i also love this app as well because you know i love love me some makeup and we have Klarna. this is name is afterpay and exporting goods when i used to work there i had the app to um keep track of my like points and stuff for um rewards and then venmo you know same as like cash out brazil and we have discovered this is for my credit card that i'm getting soon then in this box right here so i label it as apple because it's like all the basic apple apps that come with the phone so we have my watch for my apple watch and we have clock obviously for alarms and stuff the health i don't really use this anymore i used to use it to track my periods but i got a different app for that now they have calendar settings calculator and files and then the next one is another apple app this one just has my notes by my iphone and then maps on here and then the next little box thing is all my food places so we have chick-fil-a starbucks i use both of those to just use my rewards keep track of my points and stuff then doordash you know college students so we always order food and then mcdonald's same as for chick-fil-a and starbucks i use it for like the um points and stuff you know mcdonald's you can get a lot of free food for just like a five thousand points so <laughs> and we have uber eats same as doordash you know to order food and grubhub same thing i never ordered off grubhub but they have canes on there and sometimes i'll be craving canes and i'll be like maybe i should order it but then i'll be like that delivery fee make it like twenty dollars for like a pretty finger combo and who wants to pay twenty dollars when it's really ten dollars so no but that's just for that and then the next one is my pictures tab this one i used to have lightroom in here but i don't really use that to edit my pictures no more i just use the regular photos app um that apple comes with so yeah so i just have photos and then camera in here that's really all i have and on the next one is all for my youtube stuff so we have youtube studio obviously to keep track of my analytics my subscribers check out my videos doing if you're a youtuber you're supposed to have a youtube app youtube studio app like it's a necessity and we have regular youtube subscribe of course and then we have fonto i edit all of my thumbnails on here um i use like three different apps for my thumbnails if you guys want to see how i edit my thumbnails video definitely let me know i mean i use pixar that's another app i use for my thumbnails and then imovie this is mainly if i want to edit something quick like say i want to make like green screen or something like that on my phone and it trans um transfers to my computer or something i don't know it's like incorpor incorporated with editing so if you guys just want to see a whole how i edit video let me know then video star i used to use this to do like when i used to edit on my phone i had video star to do like the little um edits to like making my face like you know like when i be making a little swoosh or big like fish eyes stuff like that i used to use it when i edit on my phone and we have cap cut whenever i do like those little small like tiktok videos i use cap cut or sometimes i edit on here and transfer it to my computer i don't know i'm trying to still get the gist of cap cut because i edit on imovie right now on my computer so we still trying to get the hang of it and then canon camera connect this is for my camera so say i want to transport pictures or like small video clips to my phone i use this to connect it next is another apple folder i don't know why i have three of these um this has safari um app store and weather i think i tried to coordinate them but like the color i think i don't know but this one is just you know self-explanatory and the next app is flow i use this to track my period um it's great i mean i don't pay for it i use the free one but it's still good i think i'm about to start in like three days or and then we have life 360 obviously life 360 is to get tracked have a location i have one with my boyfriend and i have a group with my cheer friends and then i have another one which is like my family so i have i'm in three groups and the next one is entertainment this just has my podcast in here and apple music um i've been recently listening to um ava jewel's podcast so that's why i've been using podcasts recently and then music 
obviously it's all apple music um i don't know if you guys want to follow my music playlist it's kind of all over the place it's like from 2018 to like 2023 and it's a lot of music in here i've been trying to get rid of music i don't really listen to but i mean it's it's up there if you want to follow it i guess i don't know um but yeah and then next is outlook this is my school email so all of my emails that go to my school email goes to outlook that's what we use self-explanatory next is photo math photo math and i use it to help me but at the same time i use it you know if i don't have a clue what's going on so yeah and then next is travel so we have links by cats this is like a transportation service that's kind of um known in baton rouge or this area i'm in it's free for college students that go to southern so i use that sometimes then we have uber and lyft self-explanatory you know i don't have a car so we gotta use that sometimes and then booking.com i used this when i was planning my trip to disney with my boyfriend but that got canceled because southwest canceled our flights so you know the weather was bad so yeah but i used that to book our hotel and then disney world app self-explanatory again like i went to disney world so many times i just keep the app on my phone now and then i also had it when we were supposed to go to disney world in december and i had my ticket on there but obviously it didn't happen but we still got our ticket and we still going in the summer so stay tuned for that vlog and then the next one is just bit label business so this is for when i'm starting my business i had this so i have whatsapp that's to communicate with people overseas and in paypal business obviously a uh, bank account for my business and an alibaba that's to um order bulk for what i want to start my brand with i'm not going to tell you because obviously it's still in the works and then paypal that's just my regular paypal account and then my gmail that has my youtube account in there well youtube email basically so um i can check like, if brands email me or certain people email me and that is really it that's all of my iPhone like it's it's really not much on here that's why I said this was a quick video hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe I'll be seeing y'all be watching my videos and y'all don't be subscribed so you already watching me so why don't you subscribe to watch more and hit that bell so you don't ever miss my upload you know just just do yourself a favor because you're always gonna come back watching me so you might as well just subscribe so I can already be there you know you know but anyways yeah um i will see you guys next time i post and bye